Hey guys, Dr. Ahmed Al Hasni here from the Institute of Digital Dentistry. It is an honor to be here in South Korea with the team at Medit to speak to you about my topic for this session, single visit restorations using Medit Clinic CAD. Before we jump into it, let's get to know each other a little bit. As mentioned, my name is Dr. Ahmed and I'm a full-time dentist in Wellington, New Zealand, where I work in a family practice and have been heavily involved in digital dentistry for the past seven years. In fact, my first scanner was actually the Medit i500 back in 2018. I am also the director of the Institute of Digital Dentistry, a leading education provider for digital dentistry CPD and CE around the globe, both online and live courses in Australia and New Zealand. Some of you may be familiar with our brand agnostic product reviews, such as our intraoral scanner and 3D printer reviews. The picture you see is of my clinic, and I have used almost every scanner and CAD software on the market. So that is enough about me. I think we must all take a moment and appreciate what is happening in digital dentistry. Without a doubt, the digital revolution is here, and it is here to stay. We can see it all around us when we speak to our colleagues, go to expos or trade shows, and the various courses happening all around us and they're all about digital dentistry. Digital dentistry is not a fad. It is the future. It is here and it is now. And it has never been a more exciting time to be a dentist with amazing technologies that we have access to, such as scanners, CAD software, 3D printers and milling machines. Many of us were hesitant at the start, but I believe now we must accept the fact that digitization is inevitable. If you are not doing so, you are falling behind. Now, speaking of intraoral scanners, the team at Medit have done an incredible job with their releases over the past few years. Many of us will recognize the scanner you see here as the Medit i700, because the company disrupted the entire industry with this release back in 2021. And then they doubled down with further releases, such as the Meta i700 wireless and i600 just last year. These scanners have been widely popular across the entire industry and enjoyed by doctors around the globe. This was also proven in a recent transnational study I published in the International Dental Journal just a few months ago, in which over 1,000 doctors from all around the world responded. And it was clear, Medit scanners are some of the most popular in the industry. We are in a time where we see significant adoption of intraoral scanners by dentists all around the world. And this will continue to happen. For those of you who want to read the study for free, the QR code is there for you. So many people are adopting iOS devices. We know that. Once these doctors get comfortable with scanning and confident in the process, oftentimes they are left thinking, what's next? What's the next challenge? What's the next solution I can provide for my patients? What's the next step in my digital dentistry journey? And this brings us to CAD CAM, or Computer Aided Design and Manufacturing, which I have summarized here for you. More and more doctors are thinking of moving some production in-house into their clinics because there are so many benefits of doing so. Essentially, with CAD CAM, you have all your inputs, such as your scanner, your CBCT, face scanners, etc., and you put all of these inputs into a CAD software, and then you can design any restoration or prosthetic for your patient. Then your output is simple. It is either a milling machine or 3D printer, and this turns the digital design into a physical product or physical restoration for your patient. And I want to talk to you today about this middle part, the CAD part, and arguably the most intimidating for many clinicians around the globe. 
For the longest time, CAD CAM software has been dominated by three players. Ceric, 3Shape, and ExaCAD. Most doctors do not get into CAD CAM because they perceive the software as too intimidating, too hard to learn, or too time consuming, or simply too expensive. The market has not shifted for a long time when it comes to CAD, but this looks like it might change. As you have just heard from the fantastic talks by GB and Michael Lee, Medit has been working hard on their new application. I am super excited to go over a single visit milled crown workflow from start to finish that I carried out in my clinic utilizing Medit's new free application, Medit Clinic CAD. Just like Medit disrupted the scanner market, it seems like their eyes are now on the CAD market. So the patient presents to your clinic like this. Such a common presentation by dentists all around the world. You will all be familiar with this. A heavily filled lower second molar, cracked cusp, secondary decay, mesial and occlusal decay, etc. Well, what if I told you, using the Medit Clinic CAD app, you can turn this tooth from this into this, all within a single visit, and all using Medit apps. How do you do it? That's the question. Let's jump into it. First, we prepare the tooth for the restoration. Before picking up your Medit scanner, you should have cleaned the tooth sufficiently and carried out your tooth preparation depending on your tooth preparation type and material of choice. And then the key part, retract the gingiva to enable a clear scan. And in this case, I use retraction cord. Then, as usual, the vital part of the process, the data collection, your digital impression, which you will use to design your restoration. Here you can see I'm using Medit Simplified UI and a real-time scan taking place of the antagonist arch. Medit scanners are fast and easy to use. This is why they are popular. This particular quadrant scan was easily carried out with a Medit scanner within 25 seconds. The scanner can scan both hard and soft tissues and also has a lifelike texture or color to the scans. Once the scan is complete, we then move to the opposing arch. Now we are scanning the preparation. Another real-time recording you can see here of the scan being carried out. Once again, Medit scanners are super fast. This preparation was easily scanned within 25 seconds. And here, you can see the importance of gingival retraction and managing the site before picking up the scanner. The better the soft tissues are retracted, the better and faster your scan will be. The beauty of digital impressions is that if you miss some data, you can always rescan. Here you can see me go back and fill areas that are missing. The Meta Scanner has no issue finding its place again and adding to the previous scan. While also take note, it is ignoring any artifacts, like my dental mirror, the patient's cheek and tongue. And this is all thanks to AI in the software, which makes the scanning process even easier. Lastly, we scan the bite or carry out our occlusion scan. This is straightforward. You get the patient to bite down and scan the buccal aspect of their teeth. Within five seconds, the Medit software is capable of capturing the bite and correlating this to the upper and lower scans that have just been taken, bringing these scans together. A new feature recently released by the company is optimization of the bite scan to ensure this is even more accurate. So that is our scanning process complete. Now we have all the data we need to proceed with the CAD design using Medit 
clinic CAD. To begin, simply click this icon here to start the software. Medic Clinic CAD attempts to make designing as simple as possible. It is really as easy as one, two, three. Start the app, draw the margin line, and then design the crown using a library of teeth in the software. And then you are ready to mill or print your restoration. Let me show you how this works on this case we have just recently scanned. First, we start the app. The software automatically aligns the arch in the occlusal plane. The Medit software uses AI to recognize and correctly identify each tooth in the arch. As we can see, even if it's just a quadrant scan, if the scan data is good, the software will automatically align the occlusal plane very accurately. Next, we need to draw the margin line on our tooth preparation. The margin line is simple. It delineates the edge of your tooth preparation, so it tells the CAD software where does the restoration end. Now that we're starting with CAD, this can feel intimidating to a lot of doctors, but hang in there. The Medit software makes it very simple. The Medit software will automatically place the margin line for you. But like most CAD software, it does require some touch-ups to get it perfect. And it will also depend on how good your tooth preparation is. To modify the margin line, it's very simple. Simply click and drag the small green icons that you see to adjust the margin line. Make sure you zoom in and rotate your scan to view your prep from many different angles. Once you are happy with the margin line, you can proceed with the workflow by clicking Next. Now that the margin line is done, we need to place a digital tooth from our library onto our tooth preparation. Think of it like doing a wax up, but digitally it is so much easier and so much faster. You can rotate this digital tooth, make it bigger or smaller depending on your prep and the patient's anatomy. It is important to take your time during this step and align the tooth library properly. I am told Medit is working on AI that will make this step automatic without the need for library data. For now, once you are happy with the position of the library tooth, you can click Next and the Medit Clinic CAD software will join this design to your margin line. From here, there are a number of tools for you to refine your design. Add, remove, smooth tools. These are all common in CAD software across the entire market. You can easily modify and change your design to suit you and what will be best for the patient. For example, you can see here we're making this contact point a bit broader and a bit tighter. This part of CAD is all up to you, and the tools are there for you to use as you see fit. And here it is, our final crown design for this patient, which in real time took less than 15 minutes to design. Once you are happy with the final design, the MeditLink software enables you to easily export this design in any file format for importing into your CAM software or 3D printer. Most commonly, you will be using SDL files. And that is the CAD process, now possible with Medit Clinic CAD, one of the most simple and easy to use CAD software on the market and the only one that can be used with Mac operating system. And the final part of all of this is manufacturing. And in this case, I sent the design file to my mill using its CAM software and started milling my crown. Here you can see the final milled crown, which we made from IPS Emacs CAD ceramic. This was then post-processed, cut off the sprue, stain, glaze, and put it in a furnace. And you can delegate this to the team. We then can resin bond this onto our tooth preparation. And yes, with adequate minimum thickness, this can be used on a second molar. This is the final result. 
all carried out in a single visit. And I think that X-ray speaks for itself when you look at the images. All this is now possible with Medit scanners and Medit Clinic CAD. In-house manufacturing has never been more accessible with the free apps from Medit. One last example to finish this off. Another classic crack tooth. Large filling and cracks running radially and also mesiodistally. Something that is oh so common for dentists around the world. And here it is. After preparation, we scan, design, and mill our final ceramic restoration all within a single visit. Resin bonded and beautiful margins on the x-ray. And that is everything I wanted to show you today. Thank you for listening. What an incredible time to be practicing dentistry and what seems to be another incredible release from Medit. Thank you.